In this video, I'd like to discuss the Textile Screen Print Quick Quote product. This product is used within the textile product when doing a quick quote for screen printing, which is generally a table-based structure. It can do some costing. If we're looking at the, the textile product within control, and you filled in your textiles, and if you need further information on that, please review the training video on the textiles product. Once the textiles are filled in, underneath Quick Quote, you have a screen print Quick Quote and detailed image. We will get into detailed image in another video. For now, if we're looking at the screen print Quick Quote, the first th thing it wants to know is the print type. Now at this point it's a standard tease. If you have different table values or different equipment used when doing hats or other types of textiles, you may set those up as separate print types. They both set the equipment defaults as well as what tables are going to be used if we're using utilizing a table based structure. So I'm going to choose the standard tease. First thing it wants to know is the location of the first image the number of colors of that image, the price table which is basically saying which table location is it looking at. This will be the first location entered onto these textiles so it will be location one. Then any changes such as color changes and the styles that are included the styles included at the t default will be listing all the styles from above that have been entered. So if we're looking at the summary, we'll see that three different styles have been entered, their colors and their quantities. If I was not going to screen print all the textiles listed, you could uncheck the ones that are appropriate. In this case, if I was only doing a front center on two of the textiles, I may can remove the textile that is not getting the front center image. Then I can go in and say we'll do a full back. And this also will be two colors. And my price table is 2 due to this being the second image listed on these textiles. Now for the front for the one front center that wasn't getting the uh, front that wasn't getting a center we could also add maybe that one is getting a left chest. In this case I could then remove the two that are getting the front center and dictate this as price table 1, meaning this also is the first image on this textile, and these will be the second. That way it looks it up on the tables appropriately. That will give you your basic table price. If we look at the colors tab, this is a place to list the actual colors for the different images listing their locations at the top as well as any thumbnail images you would like to add for that location. The artwork, is it using the same artwork as another order in the system or another line item in the system or is it new artwork? And if it's new artwork, what is the setup time or the creative design time as well as an artwork charge? At this point, since standard tees was set up on a table-based pricing method, that is listed here, the default, as table-based. You can choose cost-based, which will look up all the parts and materials, adding the appropriate multipliers to give you a price. Now, below on the bottom right, you'll see the cost price details. If we click on that. Since we're looking at a table-based pricing structure, it is showing you what the table is based on, and that will either be the, this entire line, the entire order, which would be multiple line items in an order, 
or just this particular quote. So just the quant total quantities listed above. What that table value is coming to and the total quantity of the table where the numbers are it looks it up on the table. That gives us a table price, any additional screen charges, any other charges that might have been added. Then we get more into your costing. The press, the screens, and the dryers were all defaulted based on the print type. These could be changed, of course. Our production times are being calculated also based off the equipment, screens, and screen material details. If we're looking at a cost-based pricing method, <clears throat> those table options no longer appear, and it is breaking out both your materials, labor, and equipment cost. This concludes the video on the screen printing quick quote. For more information, please review our other videos or contact the Serious Implementation Department. Thank you.